Hello everyone, in this Bootstrap CSS tutorial, I will be discussing and showing examples of the Bootstrap CSS grid system. This tutorial is for beginners, so I will be patient and discuss things slowly. Towards the end of the tutorial, I will type some code to show you a preview of the code in action. The Bootstrap grid system is an easy way to organize your content and create responsive layouts. Responsive means that the content will get larger or smaller depending on the device that it is being viewed from. With a responsive layout, the content would resize appropriately for easy viewing from any device. Using the Bootstrap CSS grid system, you may create up to 12 individual columns across the page. The total number of columns within a row must not be greater than 12. You can see some possible combinations in the illustration shown here. In this example, we have three equal columns which are created by using three divs with each one spanning across four columns. Four times three equals 12, so this covers all 12 columns going across the grid. On the next line down, we have three unequal columns which are created by using one div that spans across three columns one div that spans across six columns, and an additional div on the other side that spans across three columns. This is the type of layout that you may choose to create if you want to have two sidebars in a main content area. On the last line we have two columns that add up to 12, one which spans across eight columns and the other which spans across four columns. On each section of this grid, I have typed out the class used to create that section. For example, col-md-4 creates a div that spans across four columns on medium devices. The md stands for medium. You may also customize this for extra small, small, or large devices. I will go more into detail on that in the future tutorial. Now I will show you an example of the Bootstrap CSS grid system in action. Make sure that you always include a link to the Bootstrap CDN within the head section of your document. You can find this link at getbootstrap.com slash getting dash started. Or you may download Bootstrap and link to it within your project. Bootstrap CSS comes with predefined classes of container, which is a fixed width container, and container fluid, which is a full width container, meaning that it spans across the entire page. Your grid system must always be contained within a container for proper alignment. Within the container, you will create a div with a class of row to create a new row. Within that row, you will create your columns with div class equals col-sm-3 for small devices and col-md-6 for medium devices. So on small devices, this will span across three columns and on medium devices, this will span across six columns. I'm adding some style to these grid sections to make them more easily viewable. Now enjoy some music while I code.
please subscribe to my channel for more video tutorials about Bootstrap CSS and the grid system. Thank you for watching and I really hope that you found this tutorial helpful.